I'm here in Candler again with Mom. And Mom, I wanted you to share with everyone uh, the phrase, just go quietly on. So many times we've called you with advice on, on hard things that we're going through, and that's always been your advice, just go quietly on. And that's always given comfort. Um, share with everyone what you mean by that. Mm -hmm. Well, we live in a very noisy world, so busy, and there's the storm rages, thunder and lightning, all kinds of trouble, tribulation, and we don't know what to do, but when we belong to the Lord, He holds our hand, and He goes with us, and we're not alone. And so whatever is going on, the storm, the blasting dynamite, we just go quietly on mm -hmm. because he holds our hand. We don't have to be scared of anything. There's a, a wonderful peace that comes when the Lord Jesus lives in our heart. And people try to find peace, of course, in this world, but you can't find it. No matter what you do, where you look, how fast you run, there'll never be peace and quietness. He's the only one who gives peace. It is written in the scripture, Thou wilt keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed on thee, because he trusts in him. And so, whatever is going on in the world, when you belong to him, there's quietness, because in his presence is quiet. And no matter what's going on in the world, and it's just a, a matter of time before he returns. We're waiting for his return. Yeah. We're resting in the Lord. It's not just a, a physical rest. Jesus said, "Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest." Not just a physical rest. The spiritual rest, the emotional rest, come unto me. Because one of these days he's going to come. He's coming back. And we're waiting for him. Rest and wait. They that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. Cave in. They that wait on the Lord. So we're waiting in expectation of his return. And another way of describing that waiting, earnest expectations is we're on tiptoes, waiting for him to come. But he is coming back. But we can have that peace and that quietness now. Yeah. And whatever is going on in the world, there's wars all around. We just go quietly on, just trusting the Lord. It's okay, honey, I'm here. God says, you know who that is? The creator of the universe, the Lord God Almighty. That's right. And since he created everything, he can handle our problems. That's right. Just go quietly on. I can handle things, honey. That's the peace of God. It can only come when it comes into your heart. It's a wonderful life, wonderful to be that way, wonderful.